As one of the first and one of the most important global commodities, porcelain helped introduce Chinese culture, art, and the name of Jing De Zheng to the world. First introduced to Europe in the 14th century, Chinese porcelain was regarded as an object of great rarity and luxury. By the late 19th century, porcelain from China, especially blue and white porcelain, had achieved a status above being practical. Chinese porcelain was so valuable then, and still inspires ceramic artists from around the world. For an exhibition in this year's Art in Action, one of the largest art events in the UK, Mia Sorosi made a blue and white porcelain piece with a dragon pattern. The artist said she is interested in the positive symbolism of dragons, both in Eastern and Western cultures. For the Art in Action show, she also used a gold luster for the dragon's flames, as she is aware that in China, gold is a color used in many different celebrations. Sorosi said many of her works were inspired by the colors blue and white found in much of Chinese porcelain. She would love to travel to China one day, and she would especially want to visit Jing De Zheng. British ceramic artist Jessie Lee also said there has been a big influence by Chinese ceramics in the UK. She was very much impressed by Chinese pottery during her trip to Jing De Zheng, and said she was delighted to see that ancient pottery making skills haven't died out. China has such amazing tradition in ceramics. How does the new potter do better? It's very, very difficult. It's very difficult to, to surpass what was already there, what was so surpass something that was so amazing. While the West is learning from China, young Chinese artists are now studying in the UK for new technology, including 3D printing and using robotic arms to make coil pottery. Jesse said the long and glorious history in China could also be a burden. According to Jesse, artists in the UK don't have that much history and tradition, but it is easier for them to create and innovate. With contributions from both the East and the West, the making of ceramics has entered a new phase. The exchange between China and Europe not only has changed people's idea of what is beautiful, but also has improved the development of this ancient art.